Welcome back to Tashkid FX for another Filecoin price prediction update and in this video I'll be giving you the latest developments that have been happening here on the Filecoin chart which at the time of this recording is holding above the 20 day MA here on the 4 hour chart which is now acting as support. We have also continued to obey the ADOTF structures where we had been seeing a bit of a breakdown to the lower side in the formation of these larger ADOTF count too in a move that has managed to get into the minimum retracement area in the formation of that with two between the $6 mark and the 4.018 dollar mark in a move that has now given us a low at around the 4.67 dollar mark and there are chances that we have now bottomed out in the formation of that with two and whatever we have been seeing over here in this short term run up to the upper side is the start of an impulsive wave to the upside in the formation of this wave three and before I get further into the technical analysis and also sketch out my target areas to the upper side in the formation of that wave three first give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and also check out the channel membership and allow me to continue with the video here on the four hour chart by first giving you a quick recap of what has been happening where you can see that after making our low at around the 2.467 dollar mark we started this massive bounce to the upper side of being the edu structures where you can see that i have this edu structure in yellow having that is the first wave then a wave two a wave three then a wave four and then a wave five giving us a peak at around the 9.515 dollar mark and after seeing the formation of that five wave structure to the upper side we completed an even larger edu wave count one to the upper side and after seeing the formation of that first wave whatever we expected next was a corrective structure in the formation of this wave two and using the Fibonacci is connecting them from the low of the first wave down there to the high of that wave one that gave me a minimum retracement area in the formation of that wave two between the fib level 0.5 and the fib level 0.78 which is a target area that we have now fully maximized and I believe that whatever we are seeing at the moment is the start of an impulsive wave to the upside in the formation of this wave 3 and sketching out a target area to the upper side in the formation of that wave 3 by connecting the trend based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave 1 then dragging the FIBs to the low of the second wave that gives me a minimum target area to the upside in the formation of that with three at the FIB level 1.618 and that is at around the 15.98 dollar mark and that is the minimum that I'm expecting that higher edu wave count three to the upper side to do and in the formation of that higher edu wave count three which is an impulsive wave I'm also expecting to see a five wave structure in formation so I'm expecting to see such a scenario over here having a five wave structure having the wave five giving us the peak for that with higher edu wave count three and also fully maximizing our target area at around the 15.98 dollar mark so that is what I'm expecting on the short term scenarios and I believe we are seeing such a scenario where we are seeing a micro edu wave count within the formation of that higher edu wave count 3 and that is better seen here on the one hour chart so jumping to the one hour chart for further analysis you can see that after making our low for that second wave we saw this massive bounce to the upper side in a move that has now given us a peak at around the 7.8 7.587 dollar mark and by first giving you a measure from this low down here you can see that the market from that low in the second wave is up by more than 61.78 percent which is a very nice bounce to the upper side and that bounce to the upper side has also been obeying the edu structures where we can term these as the first wave to the upper side then a wave two then we have seen the formation of that wave three then a wave four and i believe that we might have now picked in the formation of these wave five in that high that we made at around the 7.5 dollar mark and, and having seen the formation of this five wave structure to the upper side I now believe that we have completed an even larger edu wave count one to the upper side so we can term these five wave structure to the upper side as a larger edu wave count one to the upper side and after seeing the formation of that first wave whatever we expect next is a corrective structure to the lower side in the formation of a larger edu wave count two and using the Fibonacci is connecting them from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one that gives me a minimum retracement area in the formation of that wave two between the fib level 0 0.5 and the FIB level 0 0.618 which is a target area that lies between the 6.139 dollar mark and the 5.795 dollar mark and that is the minimum that we can expect that second wave to the lower side to do and we can term these as a higher edu wave count two so we can have that number to indicate the formation of that wave two and in the formation of that higher edu wave count two i'm also expecting to see an abc corrective structure also play out where we can term these as the wave a then there are chances that we might have now picked in the formation of that wave b and whatever we are seeing at the moment is the corrective structure is the impulsive wave in the formation of this wave c to give us one more leg down in the formation of that wave two and to fully maximize our blue target area in the formation of that wave two so that is what 
I'm expecting here on the short term scenarios and to give you the other reason as to why I believe that we must see a corrective structure in the formation of this wave 2 is because you can see that after making our law in the formation of that wave 2 the market has been up by more than 62 percent which means that for those that we are able to buy Filecoin from these low prices down here their portfolios are up by more than 62.87 percent meaning that there are chances that at this time this is when they are taking their profits and as they take their profits that's when we are going to start to see a bit of a corrective structure to the lower side like the one we are seeing at the moment in what could get us into this blue target area in the formation of this wave 2 and once that happens then I think there will be no reason for panic because that would be another perfect entry to get back into Filecoin so that you can be able to ride another impulsive wave to the upside in the formation of that wave 3 so that is what I'm expecting here on the short term scenarios and also getting back to the 4 hour chart for further analysis and also take a look at the indicator on the RSI we are trading at around the 56 mark meaning we have massive room for us to fully support lower prices in the formation of that with two also taking a look at the MACD we have been able to print a bullish cross but we are seeing a bit of a sharp decrease in the buying momentum here on the MACD suggesting that soon we might be able to print a bearish cross so let's be patient and see how that plays out and I'll be keeping you updated.